Hey guys, uh, thought ball. <laughs> yeah, you know. Uh, the other day, old dad comes up to the house. And he'd been back here in the woods. I didn't think nothing about where he'd been. And he said, hey dad, I got you, I got you something. And I'm thinking, well, it's nice. You know, it's not my birthday or nothing. I got you something, Dad. And he seemed real excited. So it must be something nice, you know. Oh, Dan then went off shopping for, for his dad. I got my collar all messed up. Yeah, you know what? That's just the way it is. That's just, that's just the way it is. He must have been shopping, I guess. And, you know, he's already stole my recipes and stuff like that. I guess he's trying to make up for it. And uh, so I said, well, yeah, what you got, buddy? He says, come look what I got you, Dad. He seemed so excited. So so naturally, I don't want to hurt his feelings or whatever it was. I'm going to say, man, I love it. So I'm going to turn around and see what he brought me. <laughs> That's my staff. He said, Daddy, Moses had a staff. I said, I'm not Moses, son. But this is my staff. Now look. It's been around a while, folks. Look, this thing's been around a while. It ain't it ain't a spring chicken. <laughs> it got a crack all the way down it. Cracks up here. <laughs> now, it is tall. It's, it's taller than I am. And it's actually pretty stout. <laughs> I have a cane. I don't think I really need the staff. And for him to go down in the woods looking for me this, I bet he didn't spend a lot of time looking for this gift for his dad. <laughs> yeah, I got my dad a staff. I can hear him telling all the guys at church, yeah. I went and got my dad a staff. And uh and so if he comes to church, y'all 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 notice it. Well, <laughs> I'm not taking it to church, Dan. I'll use my cane if need be, but I ain't gonna take the staff. Uh, you want the staff? I said, you know what you can do with that staff, Papa? <laughs> oh, Dan. <laughs> uh, yeah, I thought him, the boy done went shopping. Well, he went shopping, all right. But you know what, seriously? It's better than the one that day you want to show me that hair in the woods. He said, Dad, here, here's your something. The old banks. I was up and down in banks in here. And he handed me this thing. It looked like a walking cane. And the minute he handed it to me, it broke half in two. <laughs> God damn. It won't help. Oh, I just wanted to show y'all that. That's my staff. Well, it looks like some of my boys over here for Friday night rendezvous. It gets uh, dark later now. Oh, yeah, I got a fire going. I see a fire going. Uh, <laughs> ain't nobody here but a fire. That's all we need, Heidi. Come on. Let's throw this limb out of the way. He probably wants me to carry haul this off. I'm not gonna do it. We'll move it out of the way. All right. Hey guys. Hey Buck. Some what? Food? Okay, I'm coming in. Oh, got food. Got food and a fire. Oh, hush, people. Kippy, don't hurt him. Don't hurt him, Kippy. I better kick my shoes off here. I don't want to go in with dirty shoes. I don't want to be in trouble. Get me here and I got to stay. Get back. Dad, do you like I'm shrimp? Out and it's like, do I like shrimp? Like yeah. Fried yeah. shrimp? No. Oh, I can't. In my, um, no. It's Look, there's your plate. Let me see it. Let's my plate. Yeah, I'll make you some more if you want more. 
Pass it down here, will you? If you don't like it, then you ought to eat it. Oh, sit on this end. Yeah. If, she, if you don't want to keep that, that's what Maymay's shoes, because she's having shoes with grandpa. No, oh, we're going to keep it. It fits crystal perfect. I've already bought a school. Dan, what is this? Sam? I can't tell you where it is. Yeah, it'll just Son, I've seen things like this other places. Okay. <laughs> well, unless you've been to Louisiana, you ain't ever read nothing like that. That's what she signed her last two years. Oh, it's good. This part's good. Why don't you take this and just pick it up and take a I bite of it? It's not. Nah. I don't like it. If you need it with your hands, it'd be much better. You get the full effect. That's awesome. Your gun is probably a little bigger. It tastes pretty good. Yeah, that's a regular gun. What's that? Yeah, it's good. Should go into it pretty quick. Yeah, the answer is good. Yeah. I thought you wouldn't go beer this weekend. Who, me? Yeah. Why, why do you think that? You told me you wouldn't go beer for two weeks. He's already been going two weeks. Huh? Yeah, he's, he's already, already been going two weeks. Last two weeks. Well, I don't know. two more weeks, though, because he's supposed to take Roger fishing. That was on Sunday. Oh, okay. That's a bad dish old Dan had. Yeah, but I like the uh, dirty rice. It's good. Brown rice, dirty rice, whatever they call it. It had a lot of spices in it, but... I'm not too much of a etouffee. Like shrimp. He took G a big plate. He took G a big plate because she likes etouffee. Y'all can knock it off, people. Get around here. Get there, stop. I'll make you go home. Kippy, they're crazy. Leave them alone. They're crazy dogs. Come on, honey. Come on. Come on. All right, baby girl. Oh, I love the fire. It's kind of cleared up, guys. It's raining this morning. You can see. I took the goats out the back. And just got them back in. Got them all put away for the night. Have a little rendezvous here with these guys here for a little while. We're going to stay late. I'll stay out here maybe, maybe 9, 30, 10 o'clock, and I'm going in. So, anyway, we'll see what kind of lies they're going to tell when they all get out here. Yeah, Laura has found a hen nest, eggs. She wants to go get her. I don't care. We gotta go around this way, baby. Get it? Alright, push it back. Here we go. Pa -pa -pa -pa. Ouch. I'm barefoot. It hurts. <laughs> I get it. All right, you go get them. I'm going to watch. Those chickens, when they run out, they lay everywhere. I mean, you just have to just look for them. Her and G was in that backyard a while ago, and she happened to look through those cracks of that board there, of that wall, and she could see some eggs. And she's been, can I go get them? Can I go get them? Can I go get them? I said, yeah, baby, you can go get them. Just wait a minute. Okay. Okay. How many? How many? Seven. Seven eggs. Okay. Awesome. All right. That's good, baby girl. You did good. I'm real proud of you. Girl got seven eggs. Whoa. Big old brown eggs. That's awesome. Yeah. Thank you.
Thank you so much, baby. Your chickens did good. Another day, you ain't got to go in the soup pot. <laughs> y'all did good. Look at Papa, y'all eating y'all's dinner? And they're watching. And they're watching. Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. Yeah. And they have dinosaurs. Wow. Oh, yeah, you play with dinosaurs. Yeah. yeah. You got toast and french fries. No, that's not toast. That's oh. grilled ham and cheese. Oh, grilled ham and cheese. They just take it apart. Oh, okay. On toast. Look at y'all sitting in y'all little chairs. Yeah, I see it, baby. Don't let Bandit get it. No, Bandit no. will take it. Oh, you can turn it back up for him. That's sweet, babies. John is trying to show Prince a few of his moves. Prince trying to show Johnny some of his moves. I ain't afraid. I pop off boy, I ain't afraid. Kind of a king of the mountain out there this morning. It's, it's cool, and they love this cool weather. And I'm fixing to go in the house and get warm. You know, grown goats play just like little goats do, you know? They feeling good, they love to play. Them girl goats out there do the same old stuff with each other. Even the old ones. <laughs> Charlie got his butt busted in. That's bull. I ain't, I ain't gonna tolerate it. I'm not tolerating it, Prince. When Johnny messes up, he turns himself sideways to Prince. Then Prince can shove him. There you go, Johnny. Don't turn sideways, Johnny. Don't. Don't. Poor Johnny. He hadn't learned all the skills yet. All right, folks. I'm out here in my garden. Uh, we're hoping it's going to rain today. Today is Thursday. And if it rains... Then I won't have to water it in. But if it doesn't rain today, that's my row of okra. That's my row of squash. And I'm going to get some of this rock picked up out of here. And there's just two rows of cucumbers. And again, over the space over here is going to be where we put our raised beds in with our tomatoes and uh, peppers. Uh, right now, my project. I don't need your help. Is I'm going to mount this hose where I roll my hose up on that deal here, up on this post. Also, I'm going to mount, get it out of here, this four way. Uh, this is what's going to control. We'll put it on the top somehow here. Something like, something like so. Something like that. Not for sure exactly. And that's how I will control. This will be like a regular water hose. It'll be rolled up here on this on this deal here on the side. This hose down here will be the one that brings the water to it. And then this will be a soaker hose for over there. The second one will be a soaker hose for here. The third one will be a soaker hose for my squash. And the okra bit it's a hot weather plant. I can water it. I could possibly get another soaker hose, but I probably won't because that would take up all my spaces. So I'll probably have just a regular water hose and I'll have a, a nozzle on it where I can water it if I need to. I, I, I'll also be able to use it on my, my pot plants over here. And I'm gonna get Lex and Connor out here this weekend and try to pick up a lot of this concrete for me before we put that plastic down or that weed wrap or whatever you, weed cloth, whatever you call it. And uh, the goats are all in until the afternoon. If it rains today, I'll put them a bell of hay in here. 
If it don't rain, then I'll let them out this afternoon into the pasture. They cannot go early because you know what they do. They're tricksters. They'll come all the way around through that pasture. You see, part of the problem over here is Jake's got him and Bree been working on their, their backyard, making a place that her chicken pen and stuff. And they've got some of the fence down around there. So they can come around and just come right through it. And they're right in eyesight. A hundred yards from the uh, sanctuary. Yesterday, I'm going to sit down over here and tell y'all the story. Yesterday, uh, I come out on the porch. And I just happened to come out at the very right time. I come out and I look over toward Jake's, or past, actually past Bree's house, and I see four goats. I count them. Guess who's in the lead? Guess who? Johnny. Right behind him was Prince. Right behind him was Sophie. I take it back. I take it all back. Three goats. Those three. Those three with Johnny in the lead. And they, in time I got on my mule and got over there, Lester had captured them going into the feed room. And actually, Sophie had already got in there, her and Johnny. Lester grabbed Prince and stopped him. Sophie, and I'm going fast on my mule, fast as I can go. And Johnny then went in underneath that door and grabbed a little bag of corn and was trying to tear it open. Can you imagine? If I hadn't have seen them, and Lester hadn't been home, just three of them would have messed that place up again. So I come back, and I said, where are they getting out? Because I knew I saw them right here behind the barn. I knew they were behind the barn. So uh, Bree come out. I said, Bree, y'all had the fence down? Uh, yeah, it's, there's a space back there. We haven't put nothing up. I said, baby, the goats are coming through there going to Lester's. Okay, I'll tell Jake. I hope. And I'll check it the day before I let them out. Because I pinned those three back up. And I hope they've got that fixed before I let them out. All right, I'm going to get busy on this post here, and I'll show you what I've done when I get through with it, okay? And I've got my helper. He's got lots of energy. He's ready to help. Heidi is outside that gate over there. She can't get in. <laughs> She's sitting on the view waiting on me. So I'm going to get busy, okay? Oh, by the way, G's video that she made come out today at 1 o'clock or whatever time. It was supposed to have been for a Wednesday night video, and I couldn't get it to load. Uh, couldn't get it transferred from her camera over and load up on mine. And Brie came over this morning and got it all straightened out, so they loaded it. But she's going to try to really try to do one on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday nights. But this one is probably your Wednesday night video, and it got kind of messed up. It's it's It got delayed, so we'll try to do better. All right, I've got my hanger here mounted, and that will be for the hose to be kept rolled up that goes with my nozzle on it that I can water. Oops. My uh, raised beds. And then I've got this over here. This is the water hose coming in. It's mounted. That's gonna hold it good and steady. It's good. And I've got my uh, four-way hooked up. So I've got my, I've got three short hoses that go here and will go down to where they would join the soaker hoses. And I've got the three soaker hoses. I'm not gonna lay them out right now. I am gonna hook up these hoses and, and hook them also to the soaker hoses. And I'm waiting on my long hose I've got ordered that will go here with a, you know, a nozzle on it so I can water the other plants. It's gonna work pretty good, I think. It's good and sturdy. And this is my water supply going over to that faucet. So, anyway, I think it's looking pretty good. Uh, I think it's going to work good. I'm hoping. I'm not going to hook up my soaker hoses yet. 
uh, hook up the little short hoses that will take over to the where the plants start. And uh, you can see how kinked up they are. And so I'm going to just let them lay out here, strung out, and they'll hopefully. It's, it's actually like some fixed to rain, so I'm hoping we do get the water. And that will wet my crop in. Uh, if not, then this stuff will pass out of here by Saturday. I'll come out Saturday and hook up my soaker hoses and, and water it all in. But uh, I'm not going to hook that up until then. But anyway, I got them kind of strung out and get the kinks out of them. And uh, as you can see, like this would be the one going over over to here. This one go to the next, and this one here go over to the, the squash. This here kind of tightened up a little bit weird right here. Come all the way up. These don't. So I'm not sure if there's going to be an issue with that one or not. Uh, and this is my source coming in. Water coming in. So we'll cut them all off just in case somebody comes along and cuts the the uh, water on. Yeah, we just cut them all off. That way we won't have no leaks out here. And come Saturday... I'll uh, hopefully we get the plastic put down get some boys pick up some of this concrete out of here and that weed cloth and get my soaker hoses hooked up. Then we just sit back and watch it grow. Then I can start working on my raised plants because my little tomatoes are still about so tall. They, they need to get a lot taller before I brought you and put them out. All right, so let's, uh, I'm going to get in. This acts like it wants to rain. I want it to rain. I want it to rain. <laughs> I'm coming, baby. Papa's coming. I'm through here. You've been out here all day. You had to go back and chase Johnny away. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on, Kip. All right. All right. We're in good shape. This is where we turn the water on when we get ready. It'll flow through here up there into those faucets up there and there'll be a a regular water hose hanging on with those soaker hose are just sitting right now out of the way there'll be a hose rolled up on that with a faucet i mean a nozzle on it for the okra and my uh the okra ain't gonna take a lot and for my uh raised beds all right that's it let's go i do not want your company you just need to go away. You ever felt unwanted, Johnny? I can tell you right now. I don't want you right this minute. I want to sit here. I got to make a couple phone calls. And I don't need you bothering your papa. Okay? I don't need you bothering your papa. I love you, though. Okay? I do love the Johnny. The Johnny. I love those guys too. Oh, here comes Mama Cat. Here's Roman. Here comes my little man. He go kick some butt right now. So funny this morning. Uh, Roman didn't come in last night. He usually does. Last night he was out prowling. I opened the door, let him in this morning. And just he come in, that little guy tackles him. Comes off the couch and tackled him. Heidi, in a minute. And they wrestle. And they wrestle. Heidi, in a minute, baby. I'll give you a treat in a minute, okay? You, you gotta wait. No, I'm gonna. You see me? You see what I'm doing? <laughs> okay, doggone, okay.